Since the dawn of man, scientists have longed to travel through time. In the late 1960s, a crack team of geniuses combined their talents to attempt to break the time barrier. In the Florida Keys, Dr. Woodstock P. Havens was given the task of building a special space shuttle. Yeah, but I decided to make a submarine instead, man. So come on and join me as we float through time. seen many visions in my day, but I have never seen one as colorful as this. <laughs> Allow me to introduce myself. I am Isaiah, the prophet. Perhaps you've heard of me. I've written a book in your Bible. <laughs> it's 66 chapters long. Uh, do you know where I can find a Bible? I'll show you. Hmm? Over here? All right. <laughs> oh, no. You're all wet, it's not there. Must be on this side. Yeah. Ah, yes, this is it, lovely. Yes, here it is, yes. You, gave, you know, God gave me quite a few messages for his people, but there is one special prophecy. All of the promises that came before led to this one. And I believe it is the greatest promise of all. I believe God is sending his promise our way even now as we speak. Ah, there it is. For to us, a child is born. To us, a son is given. And the government will be on his shoulders. And he will be called Wonderful, Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, and Prince of Peace. <laughs> oh, hello, handsome. Handsome, what have you got there? A baby rattle. Oh, that's odd. Oh, you have more things? Uh, what else? Uh, a bottle? <laughs> what? Okay, oh, well, well, hold on to the bottle. What else do you have there, handsome? What? What is this? Oh, is this a baby bonnet? No, handsome, we're not talking about a baby. Yes, you're right, a child will be born, but he's so much more than a baby. He's a prince. <laughs> oh, oh, you have something? Okay, here's yeah, something. What else do you have? Oh, a crown. Well, that is good, but what, what are you looking for now? What, a raspberry beret? The kind you'll find in a second-hand store? No, 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 it's not that kind of prince. It's the prince of peace. Oh, you've got something. Oh, good, good. Okay, yes, bring it, bring it. What is... P, P. Oh, peas? No, the Prince of Peas? No, handsome. <laughs> Thank you for trying, handsome. But no, I don't think God meant for us to wait for the Prince of Peas. No, no, it's peace. Peace, that is what the prophecy says. Who can tell me what is a prophecy? Who can tell me? Yes. A prophecy? Yes, it's a message that's going to happen. And it's given from God to a messenger, a prophet like myself. Yes. And, then, and do you know that God told us many prophecies? Hmm, but 
God gives his people this message. And that's what God was doing when he gave me the prophecy that I read to you. Yes, he was sending a message of hope to the entire world. The hope of a baby prince. Oh, but oh, so much more than a baby. And so much more than a prince. God was going to send a savior. Who can tell me his name? Yes. Jesus. Yes, yes. That's his name. Yes. God. The name Jesus means God is our salvation. It's the perfect name for him. And he was born 2,000 years ago in a little town called Bethlehem. Yes, yes. You are very learned students. Yes. And God sent his son Jesus to take away the sins of just me and you or no? Of the whole world. Yes, yes. Oh, this is so wonderful. God had promised he would take away the sins. And God always keeps his promises. Now, in this promise that we read, God explained that his son would be called by many different names. Like, Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, and Prince of Peace. Yes, that's my favorite name. Yeah, yeah, well, not peace, peace, yes. That's my favorite name for Jesus. Mm. Because he brings peace to hearts of God and men. And he brings peace between us and our brothers. Imagine such a wonderful Savior that would come and do all that for us. <laughs> peace on earth, children. That's the message of Christmas. And perhaps you can share that message with someone this year. I'm sure it will bring them peace. <laughs> Well, until next time, always remember, no matter where you are in time, God is good all the time. Peace. Merry Christmas.